we're back. We're back. Donnie's car is done. And uh, what a special juice do you got? We're gonna give it the sauce. <laughs> hey, did you bring the hot dogs we were talking about before? Because this thing's gonna shoot. Dude, some we definitely. We, I think we need some marshmallows, Martin. Ooh. Uh, they would just melt. <laughs> you think well, so? Let's go check it out. Let's do it. <laughs> The next day. Hey Nick. Hi Tyler. What do we got back at the so, shop? Uh, we got the new 8Y RS3 in the shop today. Yeah. And uh, we're going to be taking this stock exhaust setup off and putting the AWE exhaust on. So, so what do we have on it now? Because we it's, put it's bone stock. We got the oh mid no, pipes, we right? have unitronic yeah. mid pipes. Yeah, yeah the mid pipes. So want to hear the stock? Rev? Let's hear it. Yeah, we definitely need to wake that up, huh? <laughs> what do we got here, Nick? Mm. Well, in this big box. Yep. This huge box. Yeah, it was big. <laughs> we have you think you can this. fit in there? We have just this. You think you can jump in there? I don't get enough. You want me to jump in there? No. You want to jump in there? You want to touch me? <laughs> you want to jump in there? <laughs> jump in. I'm not going in all there. Alright, alright. What do we got here? That's a big box for that. <laughs> it is. It is. And it's crazy how different it is from like the TTRS and the Gen Before RS3. Like you get the tips, the lollipop, and all that stuff. Now we just got a couple pipes. I'm curious to see how this works. Oh, it'll work. It looks the same. No, I Does know. It? I just want to know where, like, the exhaust exits. Yeah, well, we'll figure it out. I'm going to get good. this stock, uh, exhaust off. Let's do it. All right, Nick, what do we got here? So, the, um, the RS3 exhaust, we got the CapEx modded up, and um, 
right now the um, the open and close valves for the exhaust yep on uh, awe sends these plates we need to put these on basically if you don't put these on um there won't be a check engine light visible on the dash but what right. happens is you have half power mode the car will not hit full boost because it doesn't know what's going on on the valves in the back right um we discovered that on a, a new rs5 we didn't put the valves in and uh, we were getting half boost it, with no codes and we were wondering what was going on well once we put the awe simulators back in yeah and hung them in the rear um they're going to open and close on their own and it's going to see if it's in dynamic or if it's in comfort right um but without doing this the car will go into a limp mode so we need to make sure that we do these so awe supplies these brackets they supply zip ties you're going to yep. put them in the corner of the car sweet um so we're gonna we're gonna do that now thanks nick well nick you got the mounts tucked up yeah so basically you just zip tie them up you yep. know that side and you can see this side right here yeah so you just put them in they don't do anything but they're switching in the car so the car doesn't go into a limp mode sweet so we'll grab ramon and we'll see what uh... get a cold start ramon all right nick let's get a cold start Tyler, huge difference from stock. You yep. gotta hear this thing. Let's hear it. 